it's Shannon. And Paul. And today we have a box. Yes, we do. <laughs> so what's in the box? I'm gonna tell a story about this box. Well, they already right, know ahead. what's in the box because of the title of the video. Oh yeah. And okay. the thumbnail that's gonna be taken. Okay. But right. Shannon actually doesn't know what's in the box. Well, I, I know, you know, but I don't know. Yeah, you know, but you don't know. So for years and years and years, Paul and I have collected Disney pins. Yes. We've been on a hiatus, sort of, kind of, for the past few years. Yeah, until this last trip we went to Disney and Paul bought a bunch of pins. True. So this box right here is filled with some of our pins. Not all of yeah, them, but some, some of them. them. And Paul and I decided that, well, Paul decided it would be fun to open and go through these with you guys. And this is going to be challenging for me. The reason why it's <laughs> going to be challenging for me is I believe I love every single pin that's in this box. You might. But I also agreed with Paul that because we haven't displayed them or put them anywhere, it's time for them to rotate out of our collection. So we're going to be selling these pins off sight unseen, like... I, I'm agreeing to sell them without knowing what's in here. So, th yeah, so what Shannon's saying is right. This was actually a box that Shannon, that we packed up before we moved to this house. Shannon hasn't seen this box since we moved here. I haven't. And I wanted it, every pin that was in it, here, it, so I'm a little scared about it, this. But, yeah, but a couple months ago, Shannon was like, well, we haven't done anything with them, so, so go, we can, uh, we yeah, can they sell can just them. go. So. Yeah. So. All right, so here we go. So I thought it'd be fun Ooh. before we get rid of them to show. Just so because. I'm just going to say, I'm going to throw Paul... <laughs> For a loop, and I'm just going to say, okay. we have talked about it just a little bit thus far. We do have an eBay store. I'm going to link it below because you could have one of Shannon's very favorite pins. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe one of Paul's very favorite pins. I don't know what's in here. I'm really scared. Oh, no. I just saw a glimpse. I don't even know if they could see a glimpse. It's starting with something Halloween. Yep. Oh, my okay, goodness. So just to let you guys know, a lot, Why are of, they the, falling out? A lot of these pins are going to be many, many years old. Um, some at like 15, maybe yeah. even 20 years old. Look, Halloween 2010. This is when we went to yeah. the Halloween party in 2010. Yep. That's the only place that you could get these. Look at that. Limited edition of 1500 We paid a lot of money for that. We did. We're crazy. Okay, so pull that out. Show them. Oh, my goodness. I don't want to. I want to keep them. It doesn't want to come okay, out. Okay, while you're doing that, uh, we're going to kind of go through these sort of quick. Grumpy was one of my favorite. It is still it's one of my favorite stuck. Disney characters. I love his animation. Um, and so for a while I was collecting Grumpy pins. So I like that one. That was a trade city. And none of these pins have we ever taken off the cards yep, or anything. or worn or anything. Yeah. Why Be careful with that one. It's, two of the pins are on top of each other kind of. So ah. it, it just made it a little bit more difficult. There we go. Okay, here, let's show those first because those are my favorite. I love these them. are awesome. So these were part of the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party in Aww. 2010. So we've got Donald in the devil costume with a pumpkin bowl of candy. Daisy as a witch. Minnie as a different witch. Oh no, she's more like but, a vampire. But this is the trip. Our kids were 12 and 15. We can't sell a souvenir from when our kids were 12 and 15. 12 and 15. Yes, we can. And then Mickey. <laughs> Look at Mickey's the kitty. Cute. Yep. Oh my goodness, that one's really cute. Paul. It is really cute, isn't it? So I like the sparkly pumpkins. So Disney makes some of the coolest pins. Apparently this box is going to be filled with a lot of the holiday pins because those happen to be my favorite, yep. Halloween and Christmas. Um, it, Paul's going to like this one. There's another 2010 yeah. pin with Tinkerbell. So, I love the pumpkin. Though. Yeah, so I really like Tinkerbell and um, let me see, there's another Tinkerbell pin. Let me. I was gonna say I was going somewhere with that. I like Tinkerbell, and I really like Jessica Rabbit because Disney has a lot of female characters. But I've always felt like Tinkerbell and Jessica have been more on the glamorous side, whereas the princesses are more like on the sweet side, the way that they're drawn. Yeah. So I've enjoyed. <gasps> I've enjoyed these. Look at it. Yep, Stitch. It stitches Dracula. Yep. With the pumpkin. Yeah. Paul, this was a bad idea. Pretty cool. Okay. This one's pretty awesome. So this is a <laughs> this is a big deluxe pin. I think this was from like the El Capitan Theater or something. That's a huge pin. It really is. It's a lot bigger. So hold up, Minnie. You can see how much bigger it is. This is Mickey and Donald as pirates. And Pirates of the Caribbean being one of my favorite rides. I really like that one. Mickey's holding a treasure chest. He's got a lantern. Donald's got a torch. Donald's got a crazy menacing look in his eye, which I like. Here's Minnie Mouse holding a... Was that a cast member hat or was that just a new release like Mouse Ear hat? It has the castle on it. 
I don't remember. I don't know. It says first release on this one. Yeah. So I'm not sure. Yeah. So you can actually tell how old these pins are. Six ninety five was this pin's price. So this is like that's really old because uh -huh. they switched to this. Where they don't you know, tell blue, you how much red, they are. yellow. Yellow. <laughs> and this one's from two thousand and ten. So that's even older than two thousand and ten. Yeah, no pin is six ninety five now. Yeah. Good luck. Okay. There's min there's Minnie in the same That's Mickey. 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 This this is Minnie in the dress, Mickey. Mickey. <laughs> so, <gasps> look at this one. Another not so scary 2010. This yep. is one of the spinny pins. That's a spinny pin. So you have Mickey, um, two ghosts wearing uh, mouse ears, and the pumpkin on the spider web. Ooh, this works really good. Okay, check this one out. I love this. Here's one. Happy holidays, Disneyland. Oh wow, that's old. Paul. From 2003. <gasps> We can't get rid of that. That's history. So this is really wild because this is when we lived in California. We we're going to Disneyland every Christmas. They have the castle with the wreath around it and everything. And the castle used to seem pretty big to me. And now the castle looks so small to me at Disneyland. Yeah, we recently went to Disneyland. It's so much smaller than at Disney World. Yeah. Look, here's another one with a real price. $8.50. That's a strange price. I didn't look at it yet. Okay. Oh, no, it's another Disneyland, the merriest place on earth. Yep, that's one of the three deep pins. We used to go to Disneyland all the time when we lived in California. Yep. Hey, there's another one. That was like the, the following years or something. Oh, so we have some not on card backs. Yeah. So this was a dangler pin. Very cool. But Shannon really liked this one because it had the toy soldiers. I love the toy and soldiers. I did not realize that the toy soldiers are over there, but then over here is Goofy and Donald in toy soldier outfits. That's cute. Being goofy-ish. Look, one of the best pins you're ever going to find. It's like Darth Vader. Darth Tater! Oh, Darth Vader. <laughs> I love Darth Tater. Okay, this was a pin that I really liked. I think I've got a couple others of this style. These, to me, looked like like labels for, uh, for beer or soda cans, like in that retro style. So that has Mickey Mouse, the original. Very cool looking. I think you can actually still get this pin. This is a neat one. This is from Epcot, and it has all the countries around the world showcase in Mickey head form, and yeah. it's a spinner. I can't read what it says right here. It's small. It says... Epcot. What does it say? I... I don't know. There's something okay. blue, something red, something green. Oh, so I, I can know. see it better than you. It says, world, world showcase, probably. No, it says one... In one the meantime. music... <laughs> one world? One, one world. mouse, one world. It says oh, one, one, mouse, one mouse, one world. Okay. Going from mouse to yetis. <gasps> so this is Expedition Everest. Oh, and this is the spider pin. No. There's the little yeti as like the cartoon character. He's my favorite. Super cute. Ooh. I love him. I like him. But Expedition Everest is an awesome roller coaster. Yes, it is. I actually got that because we we bought that the first time we ever rode Expedition Everest. Oh, did we? I didn't uh -huh. that. Okay. <laughs> June Gloom. Look, this is 2009. Marked yep. from Disneyland. So I think we actually traded for that pin. I think that's why it's not on a card. Here's Mickey Mouse's Jack Skellington. Oh, awesome. wow. Okay, this this is this is going to be interesting. So this is a Maelstrom pin. Ooh. So it's Viking Mickey and Minnie in the, the longboat with the trolls kind of creeping them out. But Maelstrom, a high seas Norwegian adventure. If you've been to Disney World at any time recently, this ride's no longer there. Nope. It's now been reimagined as Frozen. Oh, that moves too. Yes, a little sword moves. Yeah, that's cool. That's a neat pin because yep. that's something that's gone. It's gone. Okay, we have a little kitty cat here in a bag wearing Mickey Mouse ears. That was from a mystery pack. This one's for Paul. Pirates I was trying of the to show two at the same time. Sorry, that's another one we traded for. Sorry. Which one's for me? Tinkerbell! Oh, yeah, okay. I liked that one because it came with actually two separate pins. Yep. And it says naughty. There was a uh, a matching pin to this that said nice. Yeah. So it was naughty. We nice. only bought naughty. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. This one's for you. Thank you. Okay. These are awesome. So I actually want to find in here. We should have the rest of this set. Yeah, here's another one. So... We have a set of the stretching room portraits Where's in Disney that? character. There we go. So these are for Haunted Mansion. So they the artists redid these. And and they do pins like these a lot. Like right now there's a Nightmare Before Christmas stretching room. These are pins. so cool though. I love Minnie Mouse as the ballerina. I like Minnie. Goofy's pretty cute too with the heart boxers. Yes. 
Yeah, these are all cool. Yeah. Probably the 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 tightrope walker or ballerina is my favorite of the portraits. My next favorite is usually this one. These are really awesome. Yep. Are you sure you want to get rid of these pins? These this are actually a bad idea. The, these are actually highly sought after. I happened to to check these out the other day. Because they're awesome and we yeah. should keep them. <laughs> Here we go. Happy everything from the Disneyland Resort. I like this one because like I said, I like the holiday pins a lot. So this has like all the different holidays. Yep. Okay, this one is cool. This is a haunted- Wow, wait, look. That was only ten fifty for that, that giant pin, pin yep. back then. I like Mickey in the center as the bunny. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this one's an awesome one. This is Haunted Mansion until death do us part. Ooh. And we have Constance the Bride with the hatchet. In the attic. It's like we're playing Clue. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was Constance with the hatchet in the attic. <laughs> Alright, so I don't know how old that one was, but the prices were still on. So it's pretty the old. Pens. Yeah, so it's old. Here we have a patriotic Mickey Mouse. Very cute. Oh, here's another one of my label pins. So this is Grumpy. Grumpy Extra Stout. <laughs> Always bitter, never boring. Since 1937. It's cute. Cool. I have a Minnie Mouse, or a, not a Minnie Mouse, uh, it's like a Vinylmation looking, but it's the Disney Princess yes. kid. I like the little pink mouse person. Go ahead and show this one as well. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> I remember this pin. I love this pin. I actually believe this pin I had seen and I wanted, and then it was sold out on all the carts and we searched to find one of these. I love this. I think you're right. We may have bought that online because it was No, sold no, out. we got this at the park. Okay. I'm pretty sure this came from Hollywood Studios. Okay. All right. Pirates of the Caribbean pin. I, I love all like the pirates pins and artwork and stuff that has like this like banner, the swords and everything. I think it's just cool. So. Okay. I have another one here in my hands. Okay. Take it out of the little bag. Look at the Cheshire Cat. He's in Christmas colors. He has a little ornament hanging off his tail. So that Cheshire Cat's a limited edition, and that actually came from a boxed mystery set. Oh, yeah. I remember that. Yep. Was, you got like four or eight yeah. different you pins. Got, yeah, you got four or eight mystery pins. And I think the Cheshire Cat's pretty rare. Here's another Pirates pin. You're either with us or you're against us, Disneyland. <laughs> it's got Mickey, Donald, and Goofy. That's a, This is a really heavy pin. It's cute. It's cool. Yeti crossing goes with my other Yeti pin. Yep. All right. So Winnie the Pooh for a long time <gasps> were our favorite characters. Oh no, that one's adorable. So we got Winnie, Piglet, Tigger, and Eeyore deco Jack. decorating their house for Christmas. That's just an awesome pin. I'm gonna just pick up some of the loose ones in here. Oh, the little green man alien. Yep. And oh no, look at Tigger as a pirate. That is a really cool pin. You don't see pins like that very often. Mm -mm. I like that. All right, here's my last label pin. And this is Jessica. It says red hot, and it's got like a, a devil tail wrapped around it. Um, so premium choice, full bodied, all natural. I don't think they still make this pin, but that's cool. I, I ended up getting that set of three of like the, the labels, which I just thought were cool. Or they remind me of labels. Maybe that's not what they're supposed to be. I'm just going to show a bunch of these in a row. Here yeah. is Minnie Mouse. I think she's supposed to be the ballet. Yes. That's ballerina. A that was from a Haunted Mansion mystery pack. That one's cute. We also have this Disney princess crown. And it has little jewels and a little heart hanging here off the bottom. Yep. Shannon went through a princess phase. <laughs> and Eeyore. Eeyore. Cute little Eeyore. We traded a cast member for that one. I remember that. Oh, no. And Sorry. that one, too. There's Pooh Bear as a pumpkin carrying yep. a pumpkin so he can trick or treat. Super adorable. And let's see. I'll show you one more right now. Here's a Cheshire Cat in black and white, like the portrait. It's like a photo. This snapshot. is like one of the mystery, like yeah. the blind bag kind of pins. That's right. All right. I'll show you this pin. We have Grumpy. Bah humbug. That's what he would say. Ooh, what's this? Oh, look at this one. Hong Kong Disneyland. This one we traded a cast member for, too. Yes. It has these little jewels hanging. Hong Kong Disneyland has some of the best pins. I've watched pin videos on YouTube, and they have amazing pins. Yep. Here is Pluto. 
I like this one because it's got a bright shiny red present in his hat. And that's cute. So at that, that Hong Kong Disneyland pin that you just showed, mm -hmm. we actually traded a pin trader for that. Like like one of the people that like set up with the binders. Oh, that's right. Do you remember that? I thought it was a cast member, yeah. but you're right. That's one of my favorite pins right there. Okay, so we have this cool Mickey Mouse head and it's made of different glitter swirly candies. Yep. And Pooh Bear and Piglet as pumpkins again. Yep. Here is, I'm thinking it's Cinderella's shoe. Yep. Which is cute. So they made uh, the shoes of the princesses <laughs> and all the cast members had those to trade for a while. I have a couple sets of those new on card that I've oh, hidden you? from you. Do you really? Yes. I, did I have not know the that. villain shoe set and the princess shoe set. I did not know that. <laughs> okay, I loved this little set of Mickey and Minnie Mouse as the ghosts. They're pretty adorable. And then I have another Mickey ghost. Oh, Isn't cute. Isn't cute? Yep. And a Cheshire cat. Cheshire cat. And another loose one. We have this little Minnie Mouse oh. umbrella with the little like water drop crystal hanging. Oh, that's cute. All right, I've got a couple more Halloween pins. So here's Tinkerbell oh, no. as a witch. This which is, is really me. cute. These are so pretty. And then we have this pumpkin is awesome. Oh. Like that shiny enamel pumpkin. Happy Halloween 2010. Chippendale. That's cute. Yep. We may have a full set of like these pumpkins with the well, different like, people in 2010. Indiana Jones and Epic Stump, uh, stump yeah. Show Spectacular. I like Mickey Mouse as Indiana Jones. Yeah. Look, that's even from Walt Disney World when they still had the, the regular price tags. Yep. All right, we have a few more things in here. These are a couple of loose pins. <laughs> a little Cheshire Cat. Look how cute that is. There's something. And then, oh, there's Tigger bouncing around. Cute. So I'm gonna give this pin to Paul to show. Okay. I like this Christmas pin here. We have the castle, we have Mickey in the sleigh and he actually moves. It's one of the yep. movement pins. That's really neat. And then we have a Mickey's Not So Scary 2010 party. These are the nephews, Huey, Dewey, and Louie dressed up as the hitchhiking ghosts. <laughs> so that's really cute. So that's the hat box. I'm thinking it's hat, bo hat box there. That would be Ezra and then that would be Gus, but that's, maybe that's Phineas. Maybe that's, yeah, it's Phineas. Probably. And there's Madame Leota on Gravestone. Because the Hatbox behind. Ghost is always kind of separate from the yeah. three. Yep. Here's another Halloween pin. I just love these Mickey Mouse pumpkins. Yep. Okay, I think that is going to be it, except for the last thing, which is going to uh, break Shannon's heart. I know. I've been leaving it Another there. limited edition set from 2010. We got a lot oh. of pins in 2010. So these are actually the bronze busts that they put up around the castle courtyard in Disney World during the Not So Scary. So we've got Donald oh, I with love a pumpkin. Those. We've got Pluto <laughs> here. We've got Goofy doing a handstand. And we've got Minnie Mouse right there. So that's an awesome set of four. Those are so cool. Aren't they cool? Those are heavy too. Those are really neat. So that's it. Oh man. Well, that is the end of the box right there. So let's see. You can kind of see we laid a bunch of them out here. Yep. Wow, that's painful because we have good taste in pins. We do. If I do say so myself. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, so I'm not gonna pick a favorite because it's gonna make me sad, but you guys can pick a favorite and let us know down below. Actually, that's not true. Let's pick a favorite. Let's pick a favorite. Um, I want to pick a favorite holiday and a favorite regular. Okay, sounds good. So, <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a lot more difficult than I thought. And I'm also going to pick a favorite loose pin. So my favorite, I'll go. Oh, okay. since you're favorite loose pin is this little Cheshire cat right here. I don't remember where we got him. We probably traded a cast member. It's like a cheapy cat. But I think he's just so goofy and cool looking. I like him. This is my favorite loose pin. Little Eeyore, June yep. Gloom. Okay, my favorite holiday. I feel like I have to pick a Halloween, even though I really love this Christmas one here. Okay. Um, my favorite holiday pin, I think, is going to be this Halloween spinner. Oh, wow. I thought you'd pick a pumpkin one. I figured I would, too. But there is a pumpkin right here on this one. I just okay. I really like this spinner pin. I think it's super cool. All right. My favorite holiday pin is going to be... Hmm. Tinkerbell has a No, I'm going to go with Happy Everything. Oh, okay, cool. I think that's just really cool. All right, and my favorite regular pin? Yeah. Non-holiday pin? Non-holiday. Um, I think I have to go with the Yeti. The Yeti, okay, yep. wow. All right, my favorite 
non-holiday. It's probably gonna be this Mickey Mouse design. It that's strange for me because Mickey. I just feel like Mickey is everywhere, so I usually don't pick him. I usually pick other people. But this design just really speaks to me for whatever reason. And it's just such a classic thing. So, um, so that's my favorite. Cool. All right. That's All right, guys. Do it. Well, you can let us know what your favorite pins were. Hopefully, you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave tons of thumbs ups and let us know in the comments because I think we have more boxes or bags of pins around and we could do this again. <laughs> So, well, the pins probably won't be as cool because they won't be the ones we had set aside to save. Yeah, these were like our favorite favorites, but uh -huh. they're still cool pins because they they're old. So, yeah. all right. So go ahead and let us know. Thanks so much for watching and we will see you next time. See you later.